Hi, I'm Sam Sicarella. I am a real estate agent for Lukey Partners, and I thought it very appropriate to um, bring you all in and to kind of share Rich's story about these properties and kind of the contents of the properties and history and the story behind them. So, um, without further ado, thank you for allowing us to do this. Oh, well, I'm honored. This is what myself and my wife, Susan, have pulled off after 30-some years of labor. We developed the largest collection of pine trees at this cold, hardy place in the world. We're at our current home, one mile from water and sewer. There's hundreds of trees on this place and the other place that are the biggest of their type in the world. They're the oldest plants in the world that's filled with rare and special specimens. The other day it was mentioned that we had uh, six million over at the other place. I think it might be more realistic, three and a half million now over there. And there'd be maybe four or five million over here. We think the house here Though I put a couple hundred K into it, it doesn't look like it's 150 years sure, old, sure. but it has the old stone foundation, but it's, you know, it's a solid house. And we put in two furnaces, two air conditioning units in this place. It re-insulated it and uh, put in new bathrooms and new kitchen and uh, put a 10,000 square foot patio that wraps around the whole place We've, it's been used as a wedding venue uh, on several occasions, and we've hosted numerous events here. A buyer would be to seek uh, profits from the things that are here. Uh, for example, arborvitaes will make you the most tens of thousands of dollars probably worth of perennials and things all over this place. There's oddities and rare things. By selling off a few good trees off the place every year, you could garner 10, 20, 30, 40,000. There's room for a lot of people's dream here in a lot of ways. There's two ponds on the house here where we live, and one pond in the other place in the kettle of the Kettle Moraine. And that was given by the founder of Woodstock's daughter. I'm proud of what Susie and I, the caper we pulled off here, we did something well. We raised $500,000 and started endowments in uh, Ghana, Rwanda, Mozambique, Haiti, and Bolivia. Thank you very much for tuning in. I appreciate your time. Um, I thought it'd be very appropriate in this case to share with you the story of this listing and property from the owner himself with such um, colorful words and a colorful story. I think it's um, appropriate that you all heard it from him. So um, I'm Sam from Lukey Partners and I appreciate your time.